taking a look at an antique violin that I have. I want to take a video of it and send it to you for your review. Possibly make an offer or give me any information you may have on the violin. Start at the top of the neck here. Uh, the tuning keys, is that what they're called? Seem to turn nicely. However, this one doesn't seem to be turning this wheel like I think it should. Uh, this one does seem to be turning the wheel. Look at this side. Let's bring it over to the edge of the table here. Turn this one. Does turn the wheel. This one does turn the wheel as well. Get a look inside here in case there's going to be any information or important part of the violin in there. Now I'll move to the body of the violin. This this part came with the violin when I got it. Once again, don't know if this is an original part. Um, this peg goes in here. When I got it, the peg was not in there, so that may be helpful information for you as well. Trying to get some very precise close-up views of this item for you. I think there's some scratches on the body here where the, oh gee, let's call it a bridge. Not sure what the correct terminology is, but uh, this item here. Looks like it might have put some scratches on the violin from just normal use. I'm gonna sit it in the violin case and get some pictures of the edges size of the violin, top of the neck. Uh, the only marking on the outside of the violin is this crown. It has a crown and the word hope. I was trying to get a real close up on this crown for you. Here's the word hope. Looking at the rest of the back of the violin. Uh, inside the violin, we have Hope and the initials, looks like initials CF. Inside the violin here. And this is the, these are the only markings I can find inside this violin case. Violin body, if you will. Let's look in the other hole, for lack of a better word, in the body and see what we can see in here, if anything. I'm going to bring this in the shade. Get some shots of it in the shade as well. Sounds like there's a part, uh, some kind of 
piece inside the violin that's rattling around. I can't seem to get a view of it though. So I don't know if that's maybe part of a peg that was put in this hole here and, and broken off or, or what. But you can hear it rattle around. So that is the violin. Um, if you got this, you probably got an email from me. My email address is Tony in Clearwater. That's T-O-N-Y-I-N Clearwater at yahoo.com. If you're interested in sharing information you may have on the violin or would like to make an offer. Thanks very much for taking a look. Have a great day.